Hey everyone, Deadbind here. Welcome back to Hardcore Tarkov, episode 21 here. As promised, we're going to hop right into customs with that uh, AKM kit that we have. And uh, yeah, I'll see y'all raid. Okay, these raids are loading in so fast now. Holy crap. I guess it's not day one of the wipe anymore, right? I've been sitting there for a minute. How fast did this load in, chat? the heck i'm i'm actually jay oh oh no that's weird lighting not a player i'm genuinely surprised we didn't die hey cynthia thank you for the cheers wild 20 seconds after i left holy smokes Really? Wow. I mean, that makes sense based on how much time is left in the raid, but... Somebody's shooting close to my left. Need those. Did you notice yesterday that the East Coast servers were loading quickly? I wonder if it's just because the player base is tipping off, but they still have all the servers that they grabbed for the wipe, you know? So, like, there's enough to fire the servers, but there, there's so many available to be fired on, you know? It sounds right to me. I have no idea if I got that first guy or not. Lovely. I mean, there's no way I'm fighting that. I don't even know how many hits I got. I should have. If I put the first one down with that first shot, maybe. But they had helmets on, and we were, were using FMJ, you know. So, bit of a bummer there. Got 17 hits, dude. GG. I should have just ran away from that. There's no reason to go from that, you know. I was like, oh, sweet. You can get two kills because they're talking. <laughs> but GG, GG. Jenkins with a can't complain about that. I think we did, did a good job there. Just that's a classic uh, lack of good bullets, lack of good armor, lack of a sight, lack of a lot of things. Okay. I think I do kind of want to change it up here, just for a second. So we're gonna go with this. This, uh, this, this, we don't need keys where we're going, so we'll use this, actually we'll use this, guess I don't have, oh I was gonna say I don't have any bandages, but we do, alright, so four or five, and that takes care of a lot of the other stuff, 17 should be okay, and I think we're gonna go hop onto a woods raid, 
see what happens. Um, and work on the Tarkov shooter kills. There's plenty of tech crates that we can get a motor from. Um, among other things. And are we good here? Do we want to use maybe just... I don't even know. I don't even know what the stats of these bullets are. I think we just use the 20, though. And then I think I'm going to use the 20, but I'm also going to fill this up. Yeah. All right, cool. So we'll, we'll mose and man it on woods um, and see how we do. All right, here we are. Talk about we're reminiscing on the games we used to play besides Minecraft on the channel. Not the not the Dead Pine FPS channel, but my Twitch channel. I don't know if that ca that doesn't count as armor, right? I think I'm pretty sure that's fine. Collect things and took them to a crafter. Collect things and took them to a crafter. That was that that like wizardry battle royale game that I played with Taffy and Brizzy like twice. I don't think we played that one consistently. I don't think he took stuff to a to a crafter in the cycle though. He did Mercutio from PUBG? Yeah, yeah. I yeah, the the unfortunate thing is by the time I got good at PUBG, it takes me a while to get decent at video games. Um The being good at PUBG was no longer good enough to retain viewers. And, like, I was actively hurting my channel by doing that. Because we were down to, like, 25 to 45 concurrent viewers on that. And that's that's a great number of concurrent viewers, by the way. Don't ever feel bad about that. But for our channel, who was hitting... Oh, this can go on there? That's awesome. Um, you know, 500 playing Minecraft. That's a little... That's a tough pill to swallow. And actively bad for that, right? So. But Minecraft numbers are down now. In general. So... Um, having a hundred people here watching us play Tarkov, it's, it's between, between, between like 70 and 120. It's usually my range. Uh, it's really awesome because that's not much different than Minecraft. Minecraft's like a hundred and a hundred to 200, you know, I think that's just overall, um, down popularity on modded Minecraft. And that's okay. That is A-OK. -okay. Started probably February 2018. Nice. Heck yeah. I don't think I can loot. No. I lurk all day, every day, sir. Can't tell much. I no, don't worry. It's fine. Thank you for lurking. Appreciate it. That's not a... I wish we had more, you know. It'll be what it'll be. I've got my philosophies. I'm pretty... I don't want to say set in my ways, but... I like I like the way I do things. And that's not... I know it's not the best way to do things. But. To true... You know... To get numbers. I'm not I'm not looking to get numbers. I'm looking to build community. Oh, the culling. Yeah, 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 yeah. You didn't... Oh, you did craft in the culling a little bit, huh? It was like sticks and rocks. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right. Well, a lot of these tech crates are empty, unfortunately. Oh, there's a morphine. Uh, May, 17 May 2015. Nice. Nice, Somlik. Yeah, no, it's been a wild ride. I, ha I have been thinking about hopping back and doing, um, like, a replay of a lot of our old school stuff. Old school mod packs. As, like, a VOD channel. Thing. If that makes any sense. I think I'd rather have the hump back because it's meds. I'm going to take this eye, uh, eye pack here. 
Yeah, I got the game when Button was Button Boy 13. Yep. I still remember that Sky Factory world that him, Headwood, and I played. That was a blast. Right, Geoterra? How you been, Geoterra? It's good to see you. I do need money at the moment. What's our goal here for this raid? Survive? Kill some scavs? wonder if we could get away with, um... Trekking along the beach here. Might be able to. I mean, like killing scavs in the field over by outskirts. This is usually just food, but I'm pretty sure the 214 key can spawn here. Or 114 key can spawn there. Maybe it is, maybe it is a shoreline key. I can never remember. Been all right, lurking like crazy. Nothing wrong with that. I appreciate that so very much. I do. I am a avid lurker myself. I'm sure Numat would remember me. Maybe not if I talked in chat, but I've been watching Numat the Nummy for close to 12 years now. If not 13. And think about that for a second. He's one of the few people that I was... I am still currently watching. In fact, he might be the only person that I still currently watch. Pretty much daily. That has been streaming longer than I have. Easier to lurk here than some other channels. That's true. Yeah, no, we're, we're lurk friendly. I saw every once in a while I call out lurkers. It is not here. Here's the thing. It is nice to know that there are lurkers about and they are actively watching and not just like, I'm going to click this. I'm going to click this tab on for dead pine. You know, it is. It is a nice feeling to know that you are there. You know, so when a lurker comes and says hi, that that feels really good. But here's the thing. I'd rather you lurk and stick around than me call you out and all that stuff. And I that's how I watch Twitch. So like, who am I to talk? Right? There's a horse there. A car kit. Uh, I really would like this horse. We're not taking that out. I also would like that money. I guess we're good on this. I really do kind of want money more than anything there. Okay, just the hot rod. It used to be flash drive tent. Like, this was... I was on the tail end of, that's like one of the few places you can get a flash drive in all of Tarkov. And that area was so contested every single raid. Not so much anymore, but that's just funny to me. Hey, thanks guys. I do appreciate the, the having that core community of people who just enjoy, enjoy my banter. Couldn't tell you why you do, but you do, and I appreciate you for that. <laughs> but no, it's pretty epic. Okay. Hey, speaking of PP ammo. I'm gonna I'm gonna take that but ditch it on the ground when we kill scavs, I think. Uh, the lunchbox isn't worth too much much to us anymore. Ah, oh, yes, the elusive three out of fifty pack of armor. I know, I know. 
PS is honestly not bad either. That's the wild part about that. Let's see if this guy has a bigger rig. He does. Oh, I grabbed a gun off of somebody. I almost want the ammo from this for our TT. I guess that is technically worth something, and it does not take up any extra space. Pretty sure this only stacks to 50. Yeah. T45M is actually not terrible either. Yeah, even PS is not, like, horrendous, horrendous. Oh, that actually might be 762 by 39 PP. Because it's only a 20-pack. Want to catch up on chat here as well. How many of these kills do I need, chat? I don't remember. <laughs> oh, no, I need, um... I need kills at a certain distance with the Mosin. It's I need to get kills on woods without a, I need five kills on woods without armor. I don't think it needs a bolt action. And then the bolt action kills need to be from a certain distance with iron sight. That's what it is. Forgot about that. So those won't count for the uh, the Tarkov shooter, but they will count for um, other stuff. All right, let's do that. Yeah, that, those those are actually pretty good. Those PP rounds. You don't need to necessarily, Amir. Um, I will say there's ammo charts out there, though. Ammo's the more important one to learn than guns. Guns don't really mean much. The type of... The, the kind of bullet is way more important. I know I need hoses, but this is how much I like building guns. Airdrop. Oh god, there's so many. this airdrop. Okay, good. That's what we want, is we want the airdrop to not... Man, I am missing hard. What? <laughs> Hello? I get that they shot twice, but that should not be a headshot, Scav. That should not be a headshot. Piss off, dude. What are the chances? <laughs> These scavs, chat. These scavs. The heck? I should have had time to get at least one more shot off, and then they start to become scary. But, like... Skill issue? That is not how these scabs should work. Holy crap. Well, that really sucks. Because that was a really good raid. We had some nice items there. Holy smokes. Correct. Those are those are bots. Correct. I, I can't believe that. I'm gen like, I mean, I can. Because it's been happening to us all wipe. And I need to adjust. But holy heck, dude. You know? No, it's not just you. They are they are 
cracked out of their minds. It's just, it feels like they're getting lucky. That's what it feels like. It feels like they're getting lucky. Lucky shots off a lot more than usual. You know? No, it's not that they hit hard, Amir. They hit you in the head, which is not what they're supposed to do. <laughs> Basically, anything that hits you in the head can win. Especially when you have a helmet on. But, holy smokes. I don't even know what to do after that. Alright. What do we have to do, I guess? So, I didn't get any of those. But I did get the, um... I did get some of this, I guess. Which we can still work towards. Getting these PS rounds will make me want to use that, um... This, uh, this thing, I guess. Man, I don't know. I... You know what I want to do? I know what I want to do. I said we were going to show this off. I need to sell that. And we're going to show this off. Let's do a hatchet factory run because fun. And it's easier to do again with the, with the key, but like whatever. But so this is this is most likely going to result in death, okay? I want to point that out. This is going to result in death, which will cost us money. That's okay. This is why I don't rely too much on the survival rate because I tend to do these where we hop into factory we are naked. We are most likely going to die to the scav that comes around the corner, let alone the other players in the map, right? But it is a chance to get a free kit. So, I'm not risking anything. So, I don't, this death should not, like, all those pistols, naked pistol deaths, they don't really count towards our deaths, right? Like, they, we didn't risk anything useful. That's the idea here. So, anyway, I'll see you on raid. Okay. I'm sure I've tried to melee Tagila. I don't think so. Oh, this is a terrible spot for this. <laughs> Search the body, Deadbind. What the heck are you doing, bud? Okay. Actually, hit him. I think he, I think he went down the first floor. I don't think he's. Yeah, that's a, that's a really tough door to come through because your gun gets put up if you if you flew to the right. The fact that we're close to getting a player kill from that is hysterical to me. We got a three hit count? Dang. Yeah, we probably blacked out one of their limbs. And see, here's the thing. That cost us 9,900 rubles. Literally lost nothing. And we're going to do it again. I'll see you in raid. I am loving how fast these are loading in. That makes this way more worthwhile. Day one, this is rough because it's like a five minute load in. These are like minute and a half to load in, which is beautiful. Same spawn. Okay. Again, our goal is to beat the scav coming around the corner here. Crap. So weird that I feel more confident with this pistol than the broken AK.
<laughs> Damn it! <laughs> that would have been so cool. I guess he knew about that too. <laughs> what what a fun angle, huh? I hit the I hit the metal because I did. <laughs> oh, that would have been so good, chat. If we got him through that little bit there. Ah. Oh. Dang. GG. GG. Oh, that would have been hysterical. All right, we're doing that again. This is too much fun. Um, and they don't even have that much time to the recording. And if we t if we convert on one of these, it's gonna be epic. I'll see you in the raid. I'm loving how fast these load-ins are. That that's really what makes this more fun. Is if the fast load-ins weren't happening, this would be super frustrating, right? Because it's five minutes, die quickly. But the fact that we're getting into these things very fast is actually pretty sick. I don't I don't know what I just completed, but we completed something. Alright, I need to fix this bleed. It's heavy, right? Yeah. We're just talking about for the um specialty challenge I might do for the live streams YouTube, and this may have already happened by the time this this comes out um is i might just delete everything or sell everything not delete everything and then buy an axe and then delete everything and start like that now see we're also joking around here but like I have a kit now, and motors do spawn on this map. Just saying. You know? So somebody with an ump is over an office. What are we working with? PSO, okay. That works. Would appear to not. A little upgrade there. So this is where if I had the factory key and I desperately needed a kit, I could just leave, right? That'd be pretty sick. I think they're just rare in general. I think what they want is you to finish a task to get them, Nako, and then um, use the barter from Jaeger to repair it. I believe that's how they want you to play it. Sounded like a Glock over there. I think there's somebody in here. I did. I didn't hear them step though. Where were the steps? Maybe they were maybe they were creep walking. I don't know. Bummer. It worked, but not the way I wanted it to. GG.
Yeah, they had to they had to been like slow walking for sure. All right, again. Okay, I love how fast these load-ins are. Now, we haven't gotten forklift spawn yet, which is that back office or back room area. That one's rough for this. I'll keep getting this. I'm okay with that. FMJ looks like. I want that Dr. Disrespect armor. Right at me. that from Walkway? Really? Didn't feel like that was from walkway. Huh. Give a sight. Is this guy? I know he's got like the most marginal angles ever. He's right in the doorway there, but like, damn. Those angles are harsh. GG, I guess. I also did not hear him walking up at all. All right, I want to go see what task we completed, if I'm being honest. <laughs> it was, um, I forgot about this daily. That's why I was confused. <laughs> That's why I was confused. Okay, the rep is the important thing from that. Yeah, the rep's the important thing from that. We'll grab that, too. Maybe I'll equip that. God, slings are so bad. I'm just going to sell it. They do craft into stuff, but I'm just going to sell it. Okay. One more time. Maybe. I'm having a lot of fun, so that's, that's a thing. One more. One or two more. I'll see you in range. All right, here we go. Whew. Oh, I'm not clicked into the game. Ah. Uh -oh. oh. Crap. It's not good. I don't got all day, Scav. I literally did not have all day. And the, the, to let this guy. Oh, that was a player there, though. Interesting. That's how honestly I was expecting more of these raids to go. <laughs> the fact that we actually even um survived that many stream snipers, that is those are not stream snipers. Uh the fact that we survived that many in a row prior to this is actually kind of impressive. So all right, we're not gonna do that again. I do wanna we're gonna do sections of those. I mean, that was what, 10 minutes of recording time for like five raids. Again, we died every single one, but here's the thing. We could have gotten out on, like, three of them uh, if I hadn't been aggressive on players because we were, like, risking nothing or if I hadn't made a mistake. Um, so, really fun. That's why the axe is so powerful and such a great find, for sure. For sure. But see, now, now I'm kind of, like, reset, ready to go, and I kind of want to go, like, hop back on woods and try to do the woods thing again, you know? So, let's get that going. And 
I would like to use this. I think. Do, do, do. I don't even. I do, I genuinely. I know the BS is pretty good, and LPS is pretty good. So we'll use LPS, I guess. So we need long range kills. And then we just need normal hits as well. I don't think there's a thing I'm willing to sacrifice there, so I guess no to that. I think I'm going to wear this. And do I have the bleach barter? I don't actually know. I do not. Okay. Maybe I am actually going to not... Uh, maybe I'm doing this. Instead, then. Just like we did last time. Just save all of our meds in there. Except for like that. And then, um, just do that. That's kind of a deal. Yeah. Let's see, let's see what we can do. Oh, no, no. And then we, do, we don't even use this. Yeah. And we'll see what we can do with this. Same thing as last time. Just, it's a SP-98 instead of a Mosin. And, uh, we'll try to get the longer range kills. We'll try to get... The long range headshots, as well as just kills without armor, and uh, yeah, we'll go from there. See y'all, raids. All right, here we go. Time to start the weekend by moving Dead Pine Stream to the living room TV. Heck yeah. Heck to the yeah. Okay, I did forget to bring money, which is kind of unfortunate. I don't love the iron sights on this. The Mosins are so much better, but well, bit busy with other stuff. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that at all. I'd be going for thorax shots here. Iron Tide's better than the default scope, so, uh, Talk about on this or the Bosun? Because the Bosun scope, I love. Somebody there. Don't love that they're wearing a shotgun. They're using a shotgun. Was that me or not? I don't think it was. I never want to be in the middle of two people. I want to be on one of the edges. I had that good information, you know? I think there's somebody up on the rocks. But I genuinely don't want to be here fighting over this. I don't even have the money for the car extract. So I think we let these two... These two guys duke it out. And then we're going to pop over and try to get this task done, I think. Oh, the SV-98. What's the default scope for that? I don't think is there a default scope for this? I don't think there is. Or if there is, what is it? And let's talk about IRL, which is a little different, I guess, because I don't I don't know what the scope would look like IRL. How you doing, best of twenty two? Who needs to hear? When you can have a cult back on. God, it really does, like, just block all hearing. <laughs> it really does. Had a busy day at work, but closing uh, into the end. Nice, nice. 
Sometimes busy days are not the worst, you know? Makes the day go by faster sometimes. Sometimes they are the worst, though. But depends on the day. Get this stupid thing off, because it's terrible. Gotcha. I just wasn't aware that this gun came with a default scope on it, that's all. But it's all good. It's all good. Not a big deal. I do kind of want to go loot up there, because there is a technical supply crate, but I think we're going to skip that for this cache. Keep moving to the center. Try to get these kills done. That's technically armor, so we're going to have to ditch that every time we uh, want to get a kill, but I'm not going to leave that behind. That's somewhat centered. Was not expecting that. Would love an M4. After all those hatchet runs, I'm, I'm feeling aggressive. You know? Which I need to not be right now, but... Well, that's how these things go, I guess. How about just a little quick peek? A little quick peek. We might be, able to, might be able to shoot somebody in the back of the head, you know? We're heading this way anyway. But also, if everybody's over here, there's the chance that the USEC camps are open. Also, there's three different Mosins on this map right now. Just saying. Doesn't surprise me. Just... There's our connection for the player interaction. Does feel like that happens every time you get close to a player, huh? I still do just want scab kills, though. So, maybe we should just skip it. We're not seeing anything, which we're not, so. Uh, I am going to take a quick peek at the USEC camp, though, to see if there's any activity. Is this right over here? Sounds like it's in the second camp, or uh, just beyond the second camp. Alright, let's focus on the sky fields. Oh, right, all the bunkers have motor spawns in them. I've totally forgot about those spawns as well on woods. Which is what probably everybody's thinking of, like, oh, that's where the wood spawns are. I'm thinking of the technical supply crates, but yeah, no, the, the ZB, ZB14 and 16 have just hard motor spawns. We should definitely be checking those. Ah, uh, for sure. I don't know if that's a player or not. Kind of running like a scav. The 
Alright, gotta take that armor off. Uh, so what we're gonna do is this. We are gonna ditch that. I'm gonna go over to this rock, which I don't love doing, but it's fine. We're gonna shoot back at Medcar. But then be able to dip if we need to. Shadows are really dark. All right, we'll give that we'll give that scab a chance to move around. We'll go check over here. So hard to hit a moving shot with. Iron sights. Hey, Cats and Dirty, how are you? No? Really? I mean, he's right there. Looking forward to some PoE today? Nice. I'm glad you're looking forward to that. Maybe there's an invisible thing in the way. Or unless that's a bush. I'm pretty sure that's the scab that... Maybe not. Because I'm pretty sure we saw him turn around and squat. <laughs> you know? But maybe not. I don't know. Bushes can squat. Can they, though? No, I think that's the bush I just shot a bunch of bullets at. That's weird. It really looks... Maybe they squatted behind the bush. I don't know. But... I'm pretty sure that's a bush that I just shot like seven times. It's really dead though. We got it. Don't you worry. I don't have that key yet. Okay, so where that light bulb is. And that fuel we can get we can get motors. Could check my kills. Very true. Um gotta do the other one. Yeah, no, definitely not kills. Or definitely no kills. Because Tarkov Shooter cares about headshots versus not. Is that a... That is a scab. Okay. 
I wasn't sure if that was a scab or not. While that other task does not care about headshots or not, it just cares about kills. That's at me. Oh, I lost my rig chat. There's I think that's him behind the shed there. Well, now that's him pissed off behind the shed there. I probably need to be closer. But right, let's go here. Ah! I think it's a player. Or a player scav. We're gonna go click soon. Yeah, that's 100% a player scav, based on how they're running. Alright, I might just leave, or get to where we can extract. I guess we could have befriended that guy, but... Meh. I will take all the blue tape we can get. They're pretty good. We did get one of the kills in the in the center there. Did we get any Tarkov shooter kills then? Yes. Okay. So we did get a headshot on the scav in the middle there. That's good. I guess it could have been the uh, shack guy as well. But these are the shots we heard earlier from that pilgrim scav, I guess. Do you think this armor is worth getting out, though? Be good for us on shoreline. Also, once I can slap a scope on here, like, I'm, I'm perfectly comfortable using this as a rifle. I, I really do enjoy the SV-98, personally. Especially suppressed. But unfortunately for that, you need a... Uh, threaded barrel mount and the actual suppressor so it's one of the tougher ones to suppress so God. Mm-hmm. 
It's been a very quiet, pleasant raid, and that was not that. Thank you for the money. I guess. Alright, yeah, I'm not really seeing scabs like we were last raid here with the Mosin. Oh, never mind. See you. Oh, Tarkov Shooter Part 2 subtask done. Which I believe are headshots. If I'm not mistaken. Yep. Oh, it's just Eliminate, too. Okay. But I'm pretty sure it was a headshot. I need to get scab kills without armor on for a task. Because Jaeger's a jerk, to put it politely. <laughs> Show myself a Galaxy Tab 9 Ultra. OMG, it's better than the 2017. Nice, Primarin. Congrats. That's awesome. Really wish I'd gotten that other guy, but I think we're just gonna hit this cash and then leave. It was a good timing on the grenade, for sure. Uh, Cam, cool. Seriously, thank you. Appreciate that support today. As always, chat. Those those tips and bits they really add up, and they really go a very long way towards uh, full time content creation. So, thank you. Let's hit this, because you never know what you're going to find. Motor? Oh. Oh, you're playing with my emotions here, Cash. Pretty sure you can craft a motor with those. Oh, man. So close. No worries, Game Cool. Enjoy that new league. Yeah, uh, sounds like some people are excited for it. You know, Path of Exile's uh, a good one. get it all done but we got some stuff done which is good so gg's on that gg's on that can't can't complain right can't complain we survived yeah two double headshots iron sights at that range is rough <laughs> i'll tell you what okay that's good these are all good uh fuel we can put into our hideout which is nice we're definitely selling that we're selling that. Let's get them. Let's get that. Let's get the fuel in. Okay, we're not turning on the fuel, but what are you gonna do? And that it, this is why um, level two will be good as well. It'll hold more fuel canisters for us.
I don't know why. I'm just not in the mood for that song. I actually like that genre. Okay. 5,000. I don't think there's a reason to not use a full stack there. It's safe. So. Okay, we'll do that. And we got to bring in some food, which we... Food is the thing we had, or have, I guess, somewhere. There's Tashunkas. Humpbacks are that. Yeah, I think I'd rather do Tashunkas at the moment. Okay, good. Good. Yeah, let's hop back into a raid. Let's get this thing done. Let's get this thing done. I will see you all in there. All right, here we go. Hey, Tipster, how you been? Good to see you. Where am I? I didn't know you could spawn here. Neat. Huh. Actually... I mean, there's gonna be scavs up here, right? Raids are going alright. Raids are going alright. Yeah. We're just, uh... Getting our armorless, uh... Tarkov shooter kills here, or attempting to. Gotten a few. But, uh, yeah. I want to get the one that gives us a bunch of PS rounds done. So I can... Move on to another map with those PS rounds. That's what I would like to do. This is another place where motors can spawn. Alright. At least we got that done. There's two more. Okay, his gun is is oh that's so frustrating. It's because he's not shooting. Uh, his gun was literally like this. <laughs> it's not where it's not how bullets work. At least we got that thing done. As annoying as that is. As annoying as that is, I'm not going in with armor, therefore shotguns are terrifying, right? And I missed two shots. Tipster, thank you for the 15 months of support. I really appreciate that. Five out of 32. Cheers. Did I loot a lot of magnets? Nice. I did not, in fact, loot a lot of magnets. <laughs> nah, it's just annoying. So, Because I stuck around because I thought I had more time to get another shot. And maybe he, maybe he backed up. I don't know. Maybe he backed up. But I don't think so. <laughs> All right. And Tipster... Holy smokes. Ten gifted subs. Nearly getting two sets of fireworks in one go. Holy guacamole. That is extremely generous of you. If you've got gifted a sub, be sure to say thank you. Enjoy those emotes. Enjoy the ad free viewing. Cheers, tipster. Thank you so much. Really appreciate that. Okay. Gonna do that. Gonna do that. What are we bringing in here to this next raid? It might be this ridiculous thing. Am I actually considering that? Also, where's my music? I hit play, didn't I? No, maybe it's just a low song.
looking for morphines. Yep, looking for morphines uh, as well. But YouTube, that is going to be next episode. Thank you so much for tuning in. Watch these all the way through. Twitch chat, don't go anywhere. We're not done um, for all those lurkers out there. But uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in. Watch this episode all the way through. We got some good stuff done there. We got a few woods tests done. Um, after this next shoreline raid, <clears throat> after depending on how that goes, we might hop back onto woods because those ZB bunkers do genuinely have uh, a lot of motor spawns. So I would really love to get that motor, motor and money to get the uh, stash installing. Um, and then I really do want to focus up on some money runs if we don't get the motor because that saves us so much space and it'll net us space. It takes like 24 hours to install. So I want to have that up and running for sure. So, but that's going to be next episode. Thank you for tuning in. Watch these all the way through. Big shout out to all those primers, all those in the Patreon that really supports the content extra, but uh, just watching is the best and foremost way to support uh, as well as subject to the channel. So good stuff. Catch you next one.